Hi, my name is Ron Dorn, and I want to present a short video as short as possible for uh, you to get information on how to do the Hawaii Lab Stage B Question 3. So I'm going to throw this open to screen share. Uh, and then the PowerPoint that I'm using to communicate this be full screen. So question three asks you to go to two different locations in the Hawaii game and extract the dew point information and the temperature information to then calculate the heat index. The idea of a heat index is that if it's super dry, meaning low dew points, even though the temperature is a given value, it's gonna feel cooler. And if dew points are higher, um, the more moisture in the atmosphere will mean that there's more of a heat stress. And Hawaii has drastically different dew points. Below the trade wind inversion at 2200 meters, they're really sticky, oppressive, uncomfortable dew points. But when you're at the trade wind inversion and above, the dew points are much drier. They're less than 55 degrees Fahrenheit. So the heat index, so a typical question would be, what's the heat index for these two spots? Um, and you can see the structure and nature of the question. So you simply go to the location and you note the dew point and you note the te te temperature. So in both of these particular places, the air temperature is 95 degrees, but the location that's really super humid and that has a dew point in this case of 55 degrees, the heat index is right about the same. Basically 55 degrees dew point, the air temperature feels really close to what it feels like. But if you go much higher on the volcano with a much lower dew point of 28 degrees, it feels like 89 degrees instead of 95. So there are instructions in their charts on exactly how to make this conversion and you simply convert the temperature using the dew point to generate a heat index. That's question three.